Connecting to people can be quite addictive. I am figuring out that all the effort that we're putting into using social media, all the effort we're spending keeping up with everybody on Facebook, on Twitter, on all their blogs, on our blogs, and the forums that we belong to, and all the special places we go, really chews up a lot of time, and you really do have to pay attention to how much you're connecting. Just because we can connect to a lot more people doesn't mean that it's very sustainable, and we do have to really pay attention to that. On top of that, if it's a business matter, if you're using the social web for business, then keep separating whether or not you're connecting to connect or whether or not you're working on your business. Because extra time spent in Twitter, extra time spent on Facebook, extra time spent reading a bunch of blog posts isn't necessarily spending time on your business. And you really do have to focus and pay attention to what you're doing and where you're doing it. Uh, I've been finding that a lot of my time that I was spending on Twitter, I was doing a lot more socializing than I was building relationships and that I was uh, really connecting to people that matter to me. And so I had to pull back and start to look at with whom am I connecting, how am I talking, who am I reaching out to that actually does matter to me and that I haven't said hi to lately. It's a really easy thing to sort of fall into what's going on on the social web and just kind of let the wave take us wherever we are. But if we're not spending extra time sort of focusing and paying attention to what matters to us, who matters to us, and where we're spending our time, it can eat us up. I'm Chris Brogan from chrisbrogan.com.